So, uh... Overcast Joker coming out. <laughs> I've not seen his Joker, and uh, he's gone different characters every week, and uh, he's been very successful with any of them, if I'm being honest. Ooh, good down to. Oh! He almost died from that. Insane. Ooh, that's a re grab. Oh, got a re grab again. Yeah, okay. Does not have to re grab again. Grabbing the ledge is optional. You can just die if you don't want to grab that ledge. <laughs> I would not take him. But, uh, yeah. See how the goes. Big Cham, almost full stock ahead. The downward guns from Joker are going to be quite a problem when Ness while he's recovering. Joker can kind of safely poke him out while he's in that Fear Thunder. Uh, wait, I'm just starting with Fear Thunder 2. Um, doesn't have to worry too much about about uh, trading with that, which can be, can be a big deterrent for a lot of the characters. Ooh, it's the Rebels. Our Sen is out, but locked in the corner again. Ooh, swinging for the fence. So back to neutral. Another F smash comes out. Big champ. Scout comes out. Doesn't find the third one. Uh, doesn't find the shield on the third one. He does find the third one. But, uh, up there, looks for the up re grab to continue the chase. But smart tech out from Big Sham there. And as in the cool one here, like that's got tech in, the place covered. Find the get fire. Looks for him, good FDI from over the Ooh, bad dash. Get some shield grab. Back throw. There we go. Looking for these up airs. Those are probably straight throws. Up airs really strong. Back throw. If he'd gotten that shield grab, that would have been good. Ooh, okay, he's taking a, a little baby lead for the first time in the set. Looking for the. He's looking for that back throw. There's the up B. Confirm that you're looking for. Good take out. Smart take out. Big Sham just wants to play it safe. Wait for Overcast to overextend a little bit. There it is. Oh. Uh, a little bit late on that. I think he's able to grab that. Ooh, no punish there as well. Oh, opposite the roll. I think just straight up, uh, just straight up back throw kills anywhere on the stage and kill off the top. Ooh, down there. Just got a full stock lead now for Overcast. He really did a good job on um, the game. Game one over to Overcast. Good job there. Uh, kind of with that second stock, just just avoiding a lot of nasty kill options. Looking out for the back airs in the corner, looking out for the back throws, uh, dashing way out of the, the old hand grab setup that uh, all the all the cheeky nest means like to go for. Let's see what happens game two. Um, I'm assuming overcast against the Joker because uh, Joker won him game one, but. Okay, so game one went to Overcast on his Joker. This is an unusual character for him. I, I've heard him start talking about it a little bit, so this is on, on my radar for Overcast characters. It's not completely out of left field, but let's see what happens game two. Hope you guys are having a good night. Uh, this is winner's round one, I believe. Brackets moving along pretty smoothly. Yes, winner's round one. Winner of this will move on to play Scubs. Uh, yeah, Scubs took it 2 over. Tip two. We got the only time Violet coming out. She only won game one with the Joker. Um, he just wants to play the game. Oh, he did get fired a third time. Ooh, jab block. That was weird. I guess I didn't I wonder if Bylos just low kill falls up because of... Okay, because of, uh... I'm just going to box. Little baby lead for... Big Sam. Cast. Pulled out the bow. Thought better of it. 
Ooh, looking for the dunk. Three grabs. Three grab for your big fan, man. Ortez does not have that punish nearly close to right. Huh. Yeah, he tried to read a roll there. Ooh, that up smash is stunning. I almost took that sub 100. Ooh, that could have been potentially a back throw, but. So he's got. Doesn't find the upper F though. Interesting. That's F to go. I guess he's at 150. That was close to 70 feet. He flips tools to shield to get out of there. Smart option. Flashback. Oh, it's like a mini box. Ooh, calls out the double jump from ledge with uh, the very safe forward smash from 1800 miles away. I think that's the longest forward smash in the game now. I love that every time they add a new character, it's just like one of those smashes. They always like put something about it in their, uh, in their reveal. It's like, ah, oh, the new longest forward smash in the game. This literally happens in Corrin. It's like, uh, Belmont. There's Corrin and there's Belmont the ones for Kyle. It's like, ah, the new longest forward smash. But, uh, Overcast again, the second stock seems to, seems to adapt. Maybe well the second stock. I know he's talked about Ness before, and, uh, he was the one who explained the Ness matchup to me in like, the way that I understood. And he basically said, like, uh, Ness gets nothing unless you give things to Ness. So if you just play, like, patient, uh, Ness really struggles to force those opens on his own. That's how he described it to me. I think in Ultimate, uh, Ness does do a little bit better. That was just not for him, but, um, if you just if you can just avoid the PK fire, Ness can't really open you up with his with his normal. He's gonna try, uh, but you should be really patient with him. Because uh, otherwise you're gonna jump right as well. So. Living to 174, big chance. This is the patience. The patience is over Ooh, Cherry's up to Hello? Sweet. kill through. I actually have no idea. That would just Second fair finds it. Uh, guys. Just wondering if I got my on my body. But uh, yeah. Big jam. Looking to close out this lock here. Uh, it really needs to close the second stock out. This is where we struggled in game one. I couldn't find the first stock. Um, yeah. Ooh, what was that going low? Off the backboard? Yeah, you did. Big jam off the backboard is out there. Ooh, Ooh roll behind that's nice. Covered, covered. Oh, there's the taunt. But uh put disrespect on the desk. Feeling confident. Nope. Now we see the force match coming up. He finds one, I think it's over, but we have seen him in a in two weeks. Two sleeper. How's it going? Uh, we've seen overcast and oh, that up. Not take a great DI from the camera. Holding full right, keeping himself alive. I'm thinking about pushing more for it. That looked like not the best DI on that back here. I'm gonna be honest, but I think it would have killed him. No hesitation. Uh, yeah, that's 2 0 for overcast on the Joker Byleth.